All right. Um, had a positive weekend in Hawaii this last week. Uh, won uh, uh, three matches. Um, had a few injuries, as most of you guys have noticed in the lineup. And uh, the guys that played did a terrific job coming up 3-0. and uh, Very proud of those guys and uh, looking forward to uh, uh, two more tough matches at home. A home opener here against uh, Nevada on Sunday. So with that, uh, open it up for questions for you guys. Coach, uh, after your first weekend of the season, um, how well do you think your players have adjusted from going into practice to live competition? Uh, better than in previous years. We, uh, we did some things different in practice. We brought the guys back a week earlier, a um, uh, week before school started. And uh, we trained differently. We did. A few, I'm not going to say exactly what we did, but we trained very differently. And I think, I think it it really helped prepare us better, uh, not only match wise, but also to make the adjustment to the uh, environment in Hawaii. Were there any individual uh, performances that you thought were impressive over this first weekend, or was it more of a <coughs> combined team performance? I thought it was a great team effort. Um, very proud of all the guys that played out there. We uh, were missing. You know, four guys out of our starting lineup, and um, we uh, we we dealt with it unbelievably well. Um, I told the guys <coughs> before we went on the trip, um, whoever I put out there, I'm, I have full confidence in you, and and uh, and they didn't disappoint. So they went out there, and and we really didn't skip a beat. So I'm very proud of those guys. It was a full team effort, and uh, looking forward for another one this upcoming weekend. Coach, last year the team won a total of three matches on the road, and this mark has already been met after the first road trip. <clears throat> has the team's mentality changed on the road, or what would you say has led to this early success? Uh, like I mentioned earlier, I think our preparation uh, for, this, for, these, for this road trip was different. Uh, I think that made a huge difference. Um, these were three matches that, you know, Probably we, we, we very well could have lost last year. And I think we learned our lessons from last year. And uh, we adjusted. We got better. And I, and I think those things attributed to it. Can you talk for a minute about freshman David Machesky's performance this last week? He just came in this January <laughs> and stepped in a number three singles and was able to have an undefeated weekend. Yeah. Um, how was his play? His play was very well. Um, <clears throat> he came in very late. He, he missed some of the preparation early on that we uh, uh, that I that are talked about earlier uh, due to some visa issues, but made it in, made it in time for for school to start and make the trip. Um, so very little preparation for him, and and he stepped in there and did an unbelievable job. Uh, two two of his matches were unfinished, but he was up, I think, a set in five three. Uh, so hoping he was going to win those. He did unbelievably well, and he's going to make a big difference for us this year. And still with quite a few starters out of your lineup, how do you look forward to the matches this weekend, uh, being your opponents, Idaho State and Nevada? Um, I'm looking forward to it. Uh, I, I was looking forward to the trip to Hawaii. Um, and I, I love coaching this team. They're a fun group of guys. They work hard. Uh, whoever is out there, you know, they're busting their butt for me, and, and they're doing a great job. So um, whoever is going to play this weekend, I know – they're going to put us in a position to win, and I look forward to it. Looking ahead a little further, uh, you just played San Francisco, who was ranked um, Hawaii on their home court. Um, how will playing against those types of schools and, and in those types of environments get your team ready for Pac-12 play? Um, well, I think every, every experience we get in advance of Pac-12 play is going to help us out. I think you can already see the difference with last year. Big moments now. Uh, we really stepped up. And we're able to bring it uh, and, and, and won those sets and won those matches. Um, so the experiences from last year have helped us out. I think the experiences from uh, that we're going to gain here the upcoming weeks are going to be huge. Um, but uh, to go down to sea level and, and, and prepare in those very tough circumstances, um, I think has made us a lot better. With the addition of the outdoor courts that <coughs> you put in this year and resurfacing your indoor facility, do you have a true home court advantage? this year? I hope so. Um, I, 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 for one, I can tell you that it's helped us on the road. Uh, we've slowed down the, the court significantly, both, uh, well, indoor, outdoor. We, we matched what we did indoor. And um, I think it's helped our preparation, and I think it's made us better for, for, for the road games. That was one of the reasons we slowed it down. Um, if it's going to give us a home court advantage, I hope so. We'll see when, uh, when we get started here this weekend.